Hello from one of the great venues in world football, the Estadio Santiago Bernabeu in Madrid. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. An action coming up from the Spanish top division, La Liga. It's Real Madrid versus Barcelona. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, hitting the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. And here's the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois begins in goal. Ferland Mendy plays with Lucas Vasquez in the fullback positions. Vinicius Junior starts with Rodrigo out wide. And hand of the task of playing up front today is Kylian Mbappe. And the Barcelona shape looks like this. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them, and a mobile centre forward. It's a good team. And this confrontation is underway. Oh, fancy footwork. Lewandowski is in position at the far post. Danger averted. Good looking pass. Robert Lewandowski in the middle. And you need your defender to take charge. Rodrigo. Well, there's a textbook example of how to press the ball. Promising move from Barcelona. Danny Olmo. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Rodrigo. Right jump in front. Oh, that is a superb save. It doesn't have to do it on his own. Now able to close down the short. Chance here. Keeping. Who can he pick out? It might still be problematic. Vinicius Jr. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Well, Jude Bellingham has become one of the finest all-around midfield players in world football. That's no exaggeration. What do you expect to see from him today? Well, I love watching him play. He's so creative, particularly in the top third of the pitch. Let's hope he performs well here. Vinicius Jr. Here's Mbappe. Oh, managing to beat him. They were playing fluid football, but then the foul, and now you would anticipate a yellow card. And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking.
goes for goal! Well, the free kick fired too close to the goalkeeper. Oh, that's a really good run. To take the lead. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Vinicius Junior. Federico Valverde. Well, that one has promise. A decisive clearance it was. Lewandowski. Here's Rafinha. Danny Olmo. Given away by Barcelona. Takes the shot. Brilliantly blocked. Valverde. Well, he certainly not alone. But they dealt with the threat first. <laughs> Bellingham. And now Rodrigo. Really good challenge. This is looking threatening. He's foiled them on his own. Just failing to hit the target. Good effort, though. Alex Balde and Barcelona being afforded too much space no possibilities in the centre the keeper was never likely to be in trouble then well those stats aren't great reading are they neither side is playing with any fluency so far and as a result we've seen a pretty dull game it has to get better Good-looking pass. Mendy. Chance to cross. Promising move. A disappointing end to the move. Kunde. Danny Olmo with it. Oh, they have it again. Vinicius Junior. Vinicius. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. Rodrigo. Mbappe with it. Mbappe tries his luck. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Let's see about the delivery. And a decent save. Full credit. The first half is in the history books here at the Bernabeu. Well, how about the first half verdict as regards Jude Bellingham? Room for improvement, we might say.
and it certainly wasn't his best half of football. He was slightly off the pace, and he gave the ball away too easily at times. But we know he can do much better, so I'm expecting more from him in the second 45. So back underway here into the second half. Well timed tackle. Kunde. What can Real do from this position? Well, it came to nothing in the end. And he has options available. Well, just fractionally wide. Good strike. Vinicius Junior. Here's Mbappe. A goal to give them a 1 0 lead. An excellent value for that advantage, you've got to say. Well, let's take another look at the replay. What a through ball this is by Mbappe. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. Underway, and that should really shake up Barcelona a bit, you would think. Balde. Barca now, it's a sector of the pitch devoid of defenders. Lewandowski is in position at the far post. No strong hand on the ball. Jude Bellingham. Now, can they hit them on the counter? Bellingham. Oh, just narrowly off target. Well, they broke with such pace and intent. Fantastic move. Just couldn't quite cap it off. Danny Olmo. Lewandowski now. Well, that's an attractive passing move, but it's all about finding an equaliser here. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Lewandowski and Barca moving the ball with purpose and the keeper getting across to stop it Fine piece of defending play to break us up. Now breaking at pace, potential danger. 
Can he take the chance? Runs it brilliantly. Shuameni. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Lucas Vasquez. The ball with Lucas Vasquez. 20 minutes to go in this one. Mbappe. And on to Bellingham. Real chance. And it's two for him today. A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop him. Well, just look at how poor the defending is here. But I have to say, it's still a very tidy finish. He looked really assured there. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Hey, to be. Here's Rafinha. Barcelona free kick. It'll be here. Well, now he's walking on eggshells, you might say. Next time it'll be yellow. Lewandowski. He could pick out a teammate. Mendy. Mbappe in the centre. A bit short with the clearance. And Bellingham. Now with Valverde. They are losing possession. This might be ideal for the counter. Lewandowski. Kunde. Well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done. And that will be a Barcelona ball. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. Rafinha. Jules Koundé on the ball. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Lucas Vasquez, well, keeping the ball as they're doing, is helping the cause. Now, perhaps they can counter from here. Oh, that was a terrific attack, but they'll be disappointed about the way it ended. Well, it's good play. They force the error, break forward quickly and create the opening. However, the finish didn't match the rest of it. Lewandowski and Torres on the ball can they hit on the break and three minutes of stoppage time to be added on trying to open them up oh he's done it but hang on Offside is the verdict here. It's not going to stand. Well, you can tell he thought he was onside here, but the assistant, I think, got it absolutely right.
regain possession. The free kick decision goes the way of Barcelona. And nicely over the top. And the referee says that will do it. It's the end of the game, and it's a victory for Real Madrid. The fans are going to be happy with this. Well, Derek, it's a comfortable win in the end. Fully deserved their victory because they dominated every aspect of the game. It was a really good result for them here today. Well, I think it was clear from the word go, wasn't it, that Penny Valverde was up for it today. Well, I have to say, that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent.